Think about the subjects that you're including. Charlotte included a wide variety of subjects. And if we are limiting the number of subjects, we are limiting the size of the room that our children get to experience. The power to receive ideas of beauty, to observe and appreciate art, are within even the youngest of children and within each of us. It, you don't have to be an artist yourself. You don't have to have a degree in art history in order to appreciate this beauty. My kids talk about these trips all the time. They remember random details and funny stories. They recall the food and the atmosphere and more than anything else, they remember the people. And that's the whole point. Nature study is a lifelong habit of noticing and observing things in nature. You could study the same thing in nature for your entire life and never learn all there is to know about it. An absolute truth can be as simple as a child finding that two plus two equals four and will never equal anything else, no matter if they're adding apples or bananas or cars. Mirrors are books in which children can find themselves and their families and their communities reflected and valued. So when students read books where they see characters like themselves who are valued in the world, they feel a sense of belonging. Our children's relationship with nature isn't dependent on our teaching, but on letting them learn firsthand all that nature has to teach them. What I want to walk you through today is just the five steps, the five steps to starting a Charlotte Mason group in your own community. My desire was to really cross cultures when we actually create this co-op. So not just in knowledge, but also like how can we embody um, this diversity um, in our co-op. The artist personality is shared by many people, and when I was finally able to understand that and understand myself, it made a big difference in my life. Who do you want to be in the situation? Think through your day. When you get your kids up, who do you want to be when you greet them first thing in the morning? <laughs>